What's good, Spider Gang? MJ here, and today we are going to be watching One Piece episode 5. You guys recommended that I start watching these in pairs since most of them are going to be left in cliffhangers, but I'm going to tell y'all like this. No. I want y'all to be left on cliffhangers, okay? No, I'm just playing. I don't really like cliffhangers, but I mean, I'm not doing two episodes. I like doing it this way. I'm enjoying the show for what it is, so I'm just gonna sit here and take my time with it. But if you guys do end up enjoying this episode, don't forget to like and subscribe to your girl because who doesn't Aww. love me? Everyone loves me, so subscribe to my channel. <laughs> And if you want to see my full reaction to this episode, do not forget to click the Patreon link down in the description below. And guys, I'm going to put emphasis on this. If you want to give me requests, you have to go message me on my Patreon. You can ask anyone on my Patreon that has shot me a message. I respond to everyone, but I am not taking requests from the YouTube comments. So if you're going to leave me a request, it has to be on Patreon. But yeah, if you want to see the full reaction, you can still go ahead and click that link too. Yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say. So without further ado, I'm gonna stop talking because I really, really, really want to see what episode five has in store for us. So without further ado, let's get into the episode. Last time we left off with Luffy calling, like he just said, calling the leader of the Marines grandpa, which is freaking insane. I have no idea what we're gonna learn about this one. Our ship is ready to sail. What's the meaning of this? Oh, shoot. I don't want to be a Marine. I'm a pirate. <laughs> okay, so Grandpa was didn't accept Luffy for who he was. Grandpa was a crappy family member. We all have those. We've all been there. The first lunch. Did he say but first lunch? Oh, no, this dude's weird. <laughs> yeah, I understand why he don't want to talk to his grandpa. Everybody okay? I think so. I ain't gonna lie, these camera graphics are, their camera looks amazing, like. You're the navigator, do something. Zoro, she in and hard to port. Hey man, y'all better act as a crew and get it done. Load the cannon in the barrel, light the fuse, then get the hell out of the way. Jesus, dude. Yeah, they clearly have no idea what they're doing. I just wanna get this off my chest. That shit was not my fault. Y'all are trash. Oh, man. <laughs> this is the worst crew ever. <laughs> By order of the Marines, lower your sails and submit to my authority. Why does his transponder thing look like him? <laughs> Ew, okay, that just looks gross, but wait a second. How did he even throw that? Is everyone just freaking, do they all just have superpowers or something? Like, oh Lord. <laughs> Not bad, boy. Not bad. Mm. You saved us! You didn't tell me you could do that. I didn't know I could. <laughs> he didn't know he could blow up like a damn hot air balloon. <laughs> hey, man, I guess you learn something new about your body every day. <laughs> Get us out of here. On it. Let's disappear. Okay, went into the clouds. I like that. She's smart. Navigator. <laughs> Oh, that's a cute little cover. So it's looking like granddad is a little salty that his uh, his grandson is better than him. That's what I'm hearing. <laughs> he got some hatred in his soul for his grandson. Somebody needs to talk to him about this and that other thing. What other thing? The grandpa thing. Are you paying attention, Zoro? Come on now. You're his first mate. Kind of seems like that falls under your job description. What the? When did Zoro become his first mate? What? <laughs> when did he, we just make that happen? Oh, you're very good at talking, Zoro. Good job. About the battle, you want to talk about it? Nope. Okay, good talk. Really, dude? Oh my god, you're horrible. Hey! You guys smell that? Hey, man, it's food. It has to be food. All he ever smells is food. It smells like butter. Soy sauce. Not you could tell what, exactly what it is. This guy is ridiculous. But I smell food, which means that there's someone somewhere cooking. Um, how did he smell it from this far away? Is that land? Can't be. There aren't any islands anywhere near here. <laughs> it's another ship, I guess. Ratier. Rosette, what's a Ratier? Bro, it says Barati. This man said Baratier. <laughs> I was confused. I'm like, huh? 
I feel like we've seen this place before. Disguise the ship so the Marines can't find us. Sail so back to Sarah Village where it's safe. Nah, let's eat. <laughs> None of the logical answers. We need to eat. We're starving, you know? That was a lot of hard work that he did earlier. Oh, wow. This place looks nice. We're very full today. I could put you on the waiting list. It's three weeks out. Damn. Nah. You'll have to excuse them. They're idiots. Of course. Right this way. So they're idiots. <laughs> Yeah, okay. If y'all really believe that that worked, sure. I got this. Very good. Bro, why you have to carry them everywhere you go? Your waiter will be with you shortly. This guy is a fish guy. He's making me uncomfortable. What kind of food they have here? Shoot, looks like everything. My goodness. Oh my god, it's making me hungry. Bro is playing art with the food. What the hell is this? Two bluefin sauté, elephant tuna, seared asparagus, and a sweet soy reduction. Not on the menu. Boredom, you old shit bag. That's what we serve. It's an insult to the meat. No, you don't like cooking our menu, fine. So this guy is a wannabe chef. He wants to do a lot of, a lot of, you know, creative chef work. They are not allowing him to. Okay. Maybe I ought to try a table outside. Only thing I smell. Is you. What is what these dudes having colorful ass hair, bro? After he apologizes for his bad manners over my dead body. All right, so he's a, a good fighter. Good to know. Good fighter. Let me find out. Wait, are they gonna bring him on board? Cause that would be badass. They'll have a chef, a navigator. Oh my god, they're gonna have a whole crew. The only thing worse than the ambiance is the food. My name is Sanji. What can I get for you? Sanji. Something sweet for someone sweet. Something wrong with your eye? Just blinded by your beauty. Really? Regular water in a regular glass. Thanks. Right away. Ew. <laughs> He's trying to flirt with her. Gross. Nami's got a boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> she didn't even remotely flirt back, like, whatsoever. She literally didn't even flirt back, and all of a sudden, they're like, she's got a boyfriend. What? I guess. <laughs> Does this guy not have another arm? I have yet to see his other arm. If we delay, we might lose track of Luffy entirely. We'll handle this problem on our own. Mm. Good try, though. He's a good cadet. He tried. Mihawk, did I catch you in the middle of something? Mihawk. What? Just killing some time. <laughs> what the heck is this guy? He's wanted too, though, so I'm confused. Yes, Admiral, I have a request for you. He looks badass. I'm not gonna lie. What the hell? Let me find out. Can you call for the sword back? Because then that's just crazy. You woke me from my nap. Oh, then allow me to make you permanent. Bro, I don't know how the heck they came up with these fight scenes, but my lord have mercy. Look at this. This dude is badass. Who is this guy? Bro was just sitting there listening to the fight the whole time. I can't eat it. Oh my god. How is he still eating? To the best crew sailing on the sea. To our victory! Yeah! There's no way this is free. So how are they gonna pay for this? We were unprepared, uncoordinated. We should be at the bottom of the sea. We're not though. Luffy saved us. Exactly. That's the, that's what we need to celebrate. New bill, sir. Thank you, my good man. No, sir. Thank you. Like, there's no way he just paid for that. Where did he get the money? As soon as I find the one piece, I'm gonna come back here, pay this bill in full with interest. I'll go pay right down. You are such an idiot. Now you're talking. Zoro drinks a little too much. Is Zoro an alcoholic, bro? He drinks a lot. Yo, 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 what you think you're doing? Come on, old man. Enough's enough. Fuck, you're not done with your shift yet. Bro, who is this guy? There were never gonna be a cook in my restaurant. Have you got it? He's gonna try to hire him, is he? I bet you that's what he's gonna do. He's gonna try to get us to get on the ship. I don't know who any of them are, but it works. I don't even think there's any liquor in this. It tastes just like candy. Except that I woke up face down under a table. <laughs> That's funny. You haven't stopped staring at it. Zoro is so, like, he notices anything. Like, he notices any little thing, but he's so serious and nonchalant about it. 6,000. I have Barry. Need room for your friends, too? No. Oh my god, uh, she's such a two-faced rat. I don't even know what she's doing and I already hate it. I'm starting to think you might be right about him. 
What is it, my birthday? Of course I'm right. No, you're not always right. Don't do that. No. Freaking Lord Farquaad. Illegal pirate stuff. You may know how to tie a knot, but you don't know shit about how the world works. Yeah, you really don't. You're kind of clueless, bro, because it's the only way you're going to get what you want is by taking advantage of what there is. Like, I don't know if I explained that correct. I sound stupid, but anyways, <laughs> you understand what I meant. This place where you can find ingredients from all four seas. There's fish there that have never been seen. I love how Luffy asks all these people, like, what's your dream? What do you want to do? Yada, yada. He tries to influence them to talk about it. And then when they talk about it, he tries to find a way to make their dreams come true. Like he did with Kobe in the beginning of the season. Like, it's so nice, man. So beautiful. Tell him what you want. It's more complicated than that. I don't really do complicated either. <laughs> you don't do regret it. You don't do complicated. Help me. What's going on? No, this is a trick. It's a trick. Zeph kicked you off the line. Yeah, well, I don't see the old man here, do you? Your funeral. Go ahead, kick and yeah, cook and show him how it's done. Oh man, that looked good. You saved my life tonight. You're not only a good cook, you're a good guy. <laughs> that was a cheesy ass line, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> you're not only a good cook, you're a good guy. <laughs> and we're gonna need a great cook if we're gonna find the One Piece. Oh, shoot. Our captain was hell-bent on finding Gold Roger's treasure, but the Grand Line was his undoing. We lost 50 ships and 5,000 men. Holy. Save yourself. Forget you ever heard of the One Piece. I don't think Luffy cares. <laughs> he feels like him and his crew can do it. Oh, my God. And then we go to this freaking goofball. Anyways, I was going to say, he feels like him and his crew could do it more than anyone else. I bet I know more about you than you do about me. You're an open book. Care to prove it? Prove it. I guess something about you. You drink. You got something about me. I drink. Okay, I like this game. I grew up in a small village, barely a village. A handful of houses in the center of a tangerine grove. I can't tell if she's lying or if he's obviously getting it wrong on purpose so that she can tell the truth. Okay, I don't know. I don't know. I'll bet you didn't have any friends as a kid. I had friends. Swords don't count. He had a friend. I had one friend. How one more than I had. Aww. Drink. Drink. Aww. He got sensitive with that topic. I heard what I heard, sir. And it seems there are different rules for different pirates. And the ocean is blue. Like, what's new? Hello? <laughs> I signed an oath to protect people, to treat everyone equally under the law. If that's not the case. He doesn't want to be here anymore. He's not gonna drink that. Don't pour him a drink. My guy isn't even of age to drink. Because I'd have to do things their way. I'd lose my freedom. Do you understand? The world is not fair. The world now is not fair, so. <laughs> a uniform. It's starting to fit you after all. He's second guessing himself. He is second guessing himself hard. Boom, boom, boom. Down goes the yard. Who are you talking Marie's to? dead in the water. Oh. I should very much like to meet this Luffy. You talk too much, bro. Which one of you is Monkey D. Luffy? Who wants to know? He knows him. Kill me, huh? Yep, I knew it. <laughs> he knows everyone. I'm going to die. Wait, what? I, Roro no Azuro, challenge you to a duel. What the hell? Mr. the best you in single combat and become the greatest swordsman in the world. You're serious. Oh. You'll see how serious I am. Very well. Bro came here for a different job and came here for this. And when I'm done with you, pirate hunter, I'll take your captain. Oh my god. This is something he's dreamed about, though, since, like, the very beginning. So he don't really care, so. If you think Sanji's gonna give up on his dream because of you, then forget it. Excuse me? You he's like, what are you talking about? In your kitchen, because your rules matter less to him than making sure a hungry man got fed. Luffy, you literally just snitched on him. Can you shut up? You are a fly to him. Something to be swatted and forgotten. Okay, that is so rude. Guys, guys, maybe we need more drinks. Stop. <laughs> when you met me tied up on that cross, what did I say? What makes you think I want to play pirates with you? No, the other thing. I kill your kind for a living? No. <laughs> <laughs> Luffy's so stupid, bro. <laughs> he said the wrong thing twice. <laughs> Will you please do something? No, because he's going to be like, it's if that's his dream, now. there you go. If it's his dream, let him do it. Way of somebody's dream. Thank you. You're the best I've ever seen, but you are not better than him. Then you're not saying he's the best. Because you're my friend, you idiot. You said it yourself. You don't have any friends. Oh, stop it. Literally stop. She's going to leave. Ooh. Yeah, I know it. This motherfucker's throwing up. Mm -mm. You drank too much, buddy. Not you took the map. Nami. I mean, she did say she has no friends. 
bro like luffy said this is something that he has wanted for a long time like this is his dream like he promised a very long time ago that he would become the best swordsman you can't take that away from him you can't well. why is she dressed like dora hey. Go ahead, Nami. Go ahead. Turn your back on your on your friends, quote unquote, right? They're your friends, right? Butho. Ugh, this does not look fun. The Marines would require my services for such a small package. Oh, I do like your hair. Hmm. Yeah, don't underestimate Monkey D. Luffy, boy. I'm no rabbit. That remains to be seen. If he still stops him with this little ass sword, I'm turning this episode off, like for real. Like. <laughs> Like, you cannot be serious right now. With that little thing, bro. Hardly. Oh, yeah, best swordsman. Fighting isn't all about strength. Stop talking and fight. You start talking first. He is whooping you, Zoro. He's whooping you, bro. Show him how it's done. One of us would become the world's greatest swordsman to ever live. I love the flashbacks. Come on. Oh. I can't tell my dream will be lost forever. You're brave. I'll give you that. That little sword hit hurt you that hard? Yeah, nah, gang. I'm good on that one. Come on, Zoro. Come on, man. I believe in you. I believe in you. This fight scene is badass. I'm not gonna lie. Oh. What happened? His sword is just broke. That's all that happened? I thought he stabbed him. Magnificent. Oh, I'm glad Nami feels like she got real friends though now, but this is really sad. Please don't. Zara! No way he actually killed him, right? No way, no way. This is fake. It's all fake. It's a dream. It's fake. Roanoa Zora, it's too soon for you to die. Grow strong and come find me. I'll be waiting. Oh, interesting. If I fail to become the world's greatest swordsman. You'll be disappointed. You never fail me. Oh my God, I'm gonna cry. I will never lose again. Zoro? This is emotional. I am emotional right now. This is a lot to handle. I'm not gonna lie. This is a lot. So for starters, I know for a fact that Zoro's not gonna die, okay? We know this. We know he's gonna be fine. We know he's gonna recover. And probably at the end, he's gonna become the greatest swordsman, whatever. Whatever, you know? Y'all, the amount of emotion that I felt in this episode. Oh my God. The episode started out so slow. Like it just felt like nothing was gonna happen. It was whatever. I don't know what happened to that chef guy, you know? Like, like everything was just whatever and then as soon as we got to that moment that moment where everything just started to come together right at the end right at the end it was like oh my god <laughs> This is possibly, if next episode is better than this one, then I'll take this back. But this is possibly one of the best episodes in the season, at least for me, at least for me. Y'all let me know what y'all thought about that down in the comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Oh my God, I'm emotional. <laughs> and y'all, that's pretty much all I have to say. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for tuning in. This has been MJ and don't ask about Spider-Man. Peace. Stop.